Clemson is the national champ in 2016. It was unbelievable, you know, surreal to, to play 30 games and go 28-2 in those games and 14-1 and and back-to-back seasons. But, you know, just so many uh, lessons to, to learn, um, so many lessons that everybody on our staff and these players will take with them the rest of their life. You know, you have such a, uh, you know, just painful moment right. uh, and, fa- you know, failure. Uh, to have the confetti fall, you know, you dream about doing something and you come up short, literally just a couple plays short. Yeah. Uh, we hadn't been to a national championship in so long. And uh, to have to come in that locker room in Arizona and talk to the team was a, it was a, a difficult thing because there was a lot of pain. There was a lot of hurt because we came up short. We took some time and then we came back and we self-evaluated. And, you know, we crafted our messages the way we wanted them to be for the year. And uh, we went back to work, but the, the, the leadership was amazing. And what I saw in our team was, was so awesome. So any breakout candidates that we should look for this year, Clemson Nation should know about and say, hey, this guy's going to step on the scene. He's been kind of waiting, but this guy's going to emerge. I think we got some guys that, you know, like, like, like a C.J. Fuller and Adam Choice, a feaster in our running back position. These three guys are really good players. Nobody know really, nobody really knows much about them, but they're gonna they're gonna they're gonna do some great things. And then and then same thing over on the on the defensive side. Uh, you know Trey Lamar, who's probably right now penciled in to take Ben Bowler's place. And um, you know you look at we got a couple young safeties. A guy like Tanner Muse, who was a freshman last year. I think he's gonna be a great player. We got several guys that I think uh, by the end of the year they'll be like, wow, kid's a pretty good player. Dorian O'Daniel was that guy last year uh, going into the season, and, and now he's back and what a year he had, and, and uh, you know looking forward to seeing him. You're gonna see a team that's gonna line up and be ready to compete every week. I think we're a team that'll have a chance to compete for this league, and that's really what we strive for every year. We don't really, we're not striving for the national championship. There's a lot of things that go into that. We're, we're striving to be able to compete and be the best in this league. Uh, if we can win this league, then you have a chance for bigger and better things. So our focus is always there, you know, just trying to, to give ourselves a chance to win this conference. And I think we'll be one of those teams that legitimately has a shot uh, to win the league and anything can happen from there.